Hello and hey, everyone. NVIDIA has released its exciting, new, innovative, incredible, and cutting edge AI image generator. And why is this so important, Rodrigo? There are already so many out there. There's Leonardo, Ideogram, Flux, Midjourney. So why is this so important? This is so important, my friend, because NVIDIA today is at the forefront. It's leading the way in graphics card generation. With artificial intelligence, you feed everything, right? Everything you use in the cloud, for example, your little tech service like ChatGPT, your little image service, your little video service, all of that, at least 95% is generated by NVIDIA's graphics cards. NVIDIA knows its own graphics card. So it has already launched its a text generator like its own ChatGPT, and now it has launched the image generator. And I hope to God that they release the video generation one but that's for the next video. Let's release it here. All right, it's free too. This is very important, but first, comment. So below you already use artificial intelligence to generate video, to generate images, to generate text. Put your name in what you use it for, let's chat. Let's go straight to my computer screen. The name of NVIDIA's image AI is Sana. So you just go to Google, super simple, type in NVIDIA Sana, and you'll find it right here. Then you click and you'll come to this site here. I'm going to right click here, translate to Portuguese. And what are we going to do? First impressions. Let's generate some images here. Let's first go through the images that people are creating. In the meantime, I'm going to talk about some differentiators. The first differentiator is that it's very fast, really fast, like one, two, three seconds, and it's already generating the image. Number two, resolution up to, there are, Few AIs that generate in 4K. Very good. And third, it understands several languages. It understands English, which everyone understands, but it also understands Portuguese, Spanish, and so on. Look, add the realism. So we got a realistic one here. We took the absolutely adorable meme kitten here in a unique cyberpunk style. And you can see here that there's the prompt. Here you have access to generate in Lego format. Apparently very good. I'm going and look how interesting this is. Look how interesting this is. 2K, so that's really cool, but it goes up to 4K. Look how cool, very good. So let's generate the image. It's super simple. You click here on demo, okay? You click here on demo, and then you'll come to this page here. Just a reminder that I'm going to show this in the video. If you wanna download it to your computer, look how amazing, but let's go. Look, it opens this site here, and then you're going to enter the prompt here. I've even tested it here with an image. It turned out really good. What are you going to do? Well, I'm gonna use this to get the prompts, uh, the master prompt. The master prompts, basically, it's a database of prompts with over 6,000 prompts, which basically only my mentees from the monetization mentoring program have access to this. All right, so we have here uh, futurism, realistic people, famous people, Disney, Pixel, and so on, more than 20 categories. Let's do some tests here. Well, let's go into futurism and then we'll pick something here. Look, there are several options here really cool and interesting ones. Let's take this particular one. Look, a good image here, very well detailed, very well detailed, and let's see how Sana will behave. All right, let's generate one with the settings we have here, and then I'll explain each of the settings. I'm going to click on run here. Look, one, two, three, four seconds, and look, it already generated. If I don't like it, I just click again. One, two, three, four, five seconds. Look, that's really cool. If I want, I can download the image. I can zoom in here to take a look. Now, let's go over to the advanced option. Here we have the issue of size and scaling of the images. So here, for example, 1024 by 1024. That's why it came out square. If I put here, I don't know, 1080 by 720, for example, something like that. There, look, it's going to generate again, but the scaling will be slightly different. And look, it's very fast. So it ended up looking like that, more or less like stories. Now, if I come here and put 720 by 1080, let's take a look here just to see what happens. Cool. We're going to test another type of image in a bit, but basically you'll be able to put it in another type of format. Look, here you have the always steps, which is basically the following. The more steps, the more detailed the image gets, but it takes longer. So let's increase it a bit. Let's set it to 30, for example. This guidance basically is about how much I want the AI to follow my prompt and how much freedom it has to create. So basically that's it. I'm going to keep the same thing here because we're getting good results. The negative prompt is as follows. Let's say I liked everything, but I don't want yellow in the image. Here is what I want. Positive prompt, the negative prompt. I write like this. I don't want yellow in the image. Done. It's going to do it. It's going to follow the positive and negative prompts. 
and it's going to remove the yellow. Here it already has the style. Look how cool Cinemate, which is no longer realistic, photographic realistic. Also, anime, manga, which is that more Japanese drawing, is digital art pixel, that pixelated fantasy style, neopunk or cyberpunk, that futurism, and 3D modeling. Very cool speed. If I want it faster or not, probably. If I set it to be faster, it will create a simpler image, let's say. Right, randomize it. What is this? More or less, the word SID means seed. So basically, essentially, the CID is the code for your image. So for example, this one here, oh, it's the code for this image. If I wanted to create an image similar to this one, I copy this CID or I just take this out, done. It's going to keep this CID here now. If I want, no, I want another model of this, but different. Then I set it to change the CID. I liked it. I can take this out or save it for the future so I can generate it again. And here is the number of images. Look how cool. I'm going to put two here and let's put two here. Wonderful. Now we want the other image here. Let's go to Ready Master. And then we come here to see. Let's check out Disney Pixel. If it turns out well, look, you can see how there's a really big library. Let's check out some animals here. The question now is whether when I use Disney, I use Pixel, which are renowned brands. Will it work? Let's just take a look right here. Let's come here. Let's put in Disney Pixel. Let's see what happens. I'm going to hit run. Let's see if it accepts this style. Disney Pixel. Just reminder, I've already seen issues because I said it without a style, right? So cool. Look, just it turned out really good. Look how cool. Now, yes, I could have put some style here, right? Indeed. So, for example, I'm going to put manga here, right? Manga. So that Japanese drawing, cool. And I'm going to take out Disney Pixar. So, I'm going to create an image of a dog in the rain. Let's see if it's going to do the manga style. Let's take a look here. Look, that. And remember, I asked for two, right? I didn't see if two came out. Comment down below if you saw if two images came out. Let's go. Oh, two images came out. Yes. And look at that. A little style. How cool. A little manga style. Let's see some other tests here. Let's see how it does now with food. Let's try food here. And then we're going to try famous people and famous brands. Let's try food here. See that just a reminder. If you want to have access not only to the monetization mentoring to make money online using artificial intelligence and building your business, but also to have access to this tool here, basically just Click the link in the video description pinned in the first comment and take a look there. Now let's do the following. So I'm going to copy here food and I'm going to leave it without style here. All right. Oh, cinematic. I'm going to leave it cinematic here to give it a test. I'm going to set the year to one second, two seconds, three seconds, four seconds, five seconds, six seconds, because it's generating two images, right? So it was three seconds for each one. Let's take a look here. It turned out really cool. It looks great. And just a reminder that I can, of course, increase it here. Oh, let's increase it. I'm going to increase it now to half here to generate a heavier image for me. And now, what are we going to test? Let's test here going back to the master prompt. Let's test iconic famous characters now. Let's test famous characters. Create turtle. How he gives you a ninja turtle. Let's see here if he lets me create a ninja turtle. Is the ninja turtle famous? Still, let's see here. Ninja Turtle, let's go. Cool. Run. Run. Just a reminder that now I made it heavier and two and more. Approximately two seconds, three seconds, four seconds, five seconds, six seconds. Ah, it didn't get that much heavier. And look, just I have created a cool Ninja Turtle here. So it created a famous character. Let's try a more famous character. Let's see if there's one here. Oh, Spider-Man. I wonder if a Spider-Man will work more Disney Pixar. Let's see if it will work. And then we'll go to famous people. Let's see if it's still allowed because it's getting harder and harder to create famous people. Here we go. Spider-Man worked out great. It turned out really cool. Not so much Disney Pixar, right? It didn't turn out very Disney Pixar. Let's try a model here. Look, I tried manga, right? Let's try a model anime. Let's see here what he does. And then we're going to famous people. Hi, everyone. You can make a lot of money. With that, I sell little packages of images and little packages of videos. What is this? animated image using, for example, Minimax and Runaway, which are video AIs such as these and other techniques. You take this image and animate it, little packages there with 20 images and two videos for 500 reais. And look, you're just learning here how to generate. Look, it turned out really well. Check this out, manga style drawing. It looks great. And now let's try famous people. Let's go quickly. Let's go to 
the folder here from Promoters Master, famous people. Let's try here, I think, look, Tom Cruise. Let's try Elon Musk here. I think I have Elon Musk here. Test of Elon Musk. Look, this is a video I made of He-Man. Very cool, it's there on my cinema channel. Go in there, you're going to like it. Look, it's just the skeleton. Here, look, Elon, Elon Musk. Let's try here with Elon Musk. Let's see. Elon Musk is famous. He's the richest guy in the world. Let's see what he's going to do with Elon Musk. Let's go. Let's see if it works. All right, just eight seconds, really quick. Oh, look how cool Elon Musk style. I forgot to change it here. The anime turned out really cool, but let's put cinematic, then we'll put photography. Let's see if it works. Let's go. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Look over there. Elon Musk worked out. Look at that. Let's try to put a heavier image. Now, let's set it to 4K and let's pick another famous guy here. Johnny Depp. Really? Johnny Depp? Shall we get Tom Cruise? Shall we get Tom Cruise? Johnny Depp. Let's get Tom Cruise here. Oh, Tom Cruise. Where is it? Tom on Cruise? Yeah, let's grab all of this. I don't know if Tom Cruise is going to come out red, right? But hey, it's Tom Cruise here, right? Let's see if Tom Cruise is going to show up here. Go. If it works, Everything is running here. The images are working well. Is it working with famous characters? It's working with brands and it's working with celebrities. Look, it didn't bring up Tom Cruise here. Let's just make it easy. Let's put it here. Um, I'm going to put the translator here, even though he understands English, understands Portuguese. Let's try it in another language. Are we going? I was testing in English. Let's test in Portuguese here. It's uh, an image, an image of Tom Cruise, of Tom Cruise. Drinking a Coca-Cola at Donald's. This in Portuguese. Let's see what happens. Easy. Prompt. Huh? And then I put it in Donald, Coca-Cola, and Tom Cruise. Let's see if it will respect anything here. Let's go. Yeah. Coca-Cola worked. Donald, I don't know. But maybe it's because he doesn't know it's Tom Cruise, right? Very difficult, right? Let's try here again. No, Elon Musk has already been... Let's wrap it up here. With Donald Trump who is the president of the United States, right? Who is the new president of the United States, right? Let's see here, because sometimes it's because his database doesn't have Tom Cruise, right? Let's put an image of Donald Trump drinking a Coca-Cola at Donald's. Let's see, Coca-Cola worked. And let's take a look at Donald Trump now to wrap things up nicely. All right, that certainly worked. Coca-Cola, Donald Trump, and Donald, amazing. One option that for now is free from Wikipedia. The company with the coolest, top-notch, most advanced brand of artificial intelligence boards in the world is now releasing this image creation called Sana. So, did you like it? Are you going to use it? Comment down below, I want to know. Just a reminder, like the video, hype the video, leave your comment, and subscribe to the channel. Everything you already know, alright.